Mom Purcell. Our home. Now maybe Samuelion will admit have grown up. You better send them a signal or Jiro Bato will fire on us. There anyone on guard? Jiro Batal! Patan! Sambilion, where are you? Come on, quit it! It's not funny! I. There's no trace of fighting. They haven't been attacked. They can't have disappeared into thin air. Look, everyone! There's someone over there behind the cliff! Take cover! Look out behind you! They're on you! Sea Spider, who did this to you? Poor man. I believe he's delirious. Uh, one day a ship appeared on the horizon. We thought it was you returning to Mompresim. But she turned out to be an English merchantman. Jiro Bato got very excited. Attack them! <laughs> Sambilion did his best to persuade us not to engage them. Sandokan left strict orders for all of us. No attacks! You mustn't do this and you'd know it! We had to push him aboard. We were just within range and Jiro Batol was firing when... <gasps> we realized that the merchantman had an escort of two frigates. Lost, but wise old Samiglion came up with a plan. We have to make for home. Never. It would be like giving them Montpresem as a gift. We'll let them follow us towards Samarinda. See, Spider, you're the strongest swimmer. You make it back to Montpresem, wait for Sandokan, and tell him what happened. <laughs> <laughs> They sailed away. It was the very last I saw of them. Who knows where they are now? We have been cooped up in here for a thousand years. It's no use fooling ourselves. No one has escaped from Samarinda Tower since it was built a thousand years ago. By now, Sea Spider is sure to have spoken with Sandokan. All we have to do is wait. We'll be rescued, I guarantee it. In the meantime, I'm going out of my mind! Shh! Be quiet. It's broke! Curse him! He's here before Sandokan can rescue us. Captain Mitchell, in your dispatch, you claim to have captured all of them, but where's Sandokan? Sir, I don't know. I don't care about those four petty footpads. I want Sandokan! They'll tell us everything, sir. We have ways of making them talk. I have no time to waste, Captain. Announce that Sandokan has four days to turn himself in, or his men will be hanged in the main square. Yes, sir! Give prominence to this announcement, and make sure it is spread quickly throughout Borneo. You're in a mortal trap, Sandokan. If you come, you're mine. If you don't come, word of your cowardice will spread through Borneo like wildfire, and your myth will be shattered. If the outlaw known as Sandokan does not turn himself in within four days, his companions will be hanged in the main square. We were lucky to find this village. The ship will be safe here. Hey, little brother. The chief wanted three diamonds for the mules and for guarding our ship. Money well spent. The English will be expecting us to enter Samarinda by sea, not by land. But we're not really dressed for this, are we? You'll find a change of clothes in the baskets, my lady. If the outlaw known as Sandahan does not turn himself in within four days, his companions... Enough! The they have been square. shrieking that since yesterday! They want to oh. make sure the news reaches Sandokan. Curse them! Even if you could rip those bars out of the walls, how could you get away? Resign yourselves, my friends. There is only one thing we can do. Just wait for Sandokan. I tell you, he will come. Sandokan. 
Falcon will never allow his men to be hanged. I'm sure he will come. With his life at stake, he will never come. He will be here, I'm sure of it, but just to be hanged with the rest of them. The situation's pretty grim. I may know someone who can help us. Try to find us a safe place to spend the night. Hmm. Buy some nice fresh huh? food, sir? What have you found out? There are 20 soldiers in the tower, and my uncle just arrived. Some big young won't talk, he'd kill himself first. He's an old man, and they've been questioning him for an hour. Why throw your life away for three ungrateful companions and a leader who has abandoned you? I could be persuaded to turn, shall we say, a blind eye to your past. These are for you. Just tell me where his hideaway is. Maybe treachery is usual for you and your kind, but I am a man of honor, Brooke. You degraded filth. Just for that, I'll have your tongue torn out before I hang you and your friends. I offer 25 to 1 against Sandokan's arrival, his men being hanged 5 to 1 on the English. On Sandokan? Oh. I suspect the inside information. Gentlemen, the betting is closed. Oh. Are you refusing a bet, Yang Li? I refuse when I know I cannot win. The real reason I'm here is because I need your help. I need a hiding place for a day or two. Now your turn. The only thing beat a five is a three. You have good hideout in the floating city, my friend. There's more to it than that, Chum. <sighs> I'm tired of this filthy place. I don't want to work here anymore. You have debts to pay. Sooner than you think. Take my word, my boy. Things can only get worse. I can pay well. Lord Brooke would pay more for your friend's head. Much more. Trying to work up the price, huh? We have saying where I come from. It's better to be live pauper than rich corpse. Anyway, I will see what I can do. Thank you, Yang Li. <sighs> Fresh fruit to quench your thirst. Fresh fruit. Get out of the way. What's the matter? You afraid the prisoners will escape? <laughs> escape? That door is open only once a day for the changing of the guard. The only way a prisoner can get out of the tower is when he's escorted by the hangman. <laughs> there has to be a way in. Not even Yang Li will act against Brooke. There's only one day left. We need a plan. Only one person can get into the tower, the hangman. A hangman? Well, perhaps it's madness, but tomorrow, Yanitz, ask Yang Li if he'll hide us in his sampans. What on earth do sampans have to do with Brook or the tower, or with hangman, or with setting our friends free? Just do it. Halt and be recognized! So you have found his blonde friend, but know nothing about Sandokan's whereabouts. That information too will come. Once I have my hands on Sandokan, you'll receive a generous sum. I expect to be able to tell you everything by tomorrow night at this time. Take this. It's a pass that gives you access to me at any hour, night or day. These are your customers, Sambal. I'll do a good job, Your Excellency. It'll be the event of the year. I want all Borneo to come. My executions are always memorable spectacles. Except if Sandokan comes, you'll only have one neck to demonstrate your skill on. Which, of course, is what you're all waiting for. Am I not right? You are not right. We value Sandokan's life more highly than our own. You'll have the chance to prove it, since he'll never have the courage to save you. <laughs> 
The execution will draw people from all over Borneo. The hangman always brings good business. Sounds like the hangman's a pretty important person around here. Load it carefully. Thank you, ma'am. I'll take the barrels to the sandpan. You've got company, Paco. Hello, Mr. Foreigner. Enjoying yourself? I saw your number the other day. It was very good. Where did you learn how to do that? Underwater. Really? You and your cat? No, I started as a pearl fisher. I practiced with sharks. I don't think your kitty likes us very much. But she doesn't decide who I like and who I don't. Be wary of Mei Ling, my friend. She beautiful, but she bring many a man to grief. Next. Mm. All right, let's have a look in that basket. <gasps> yeah! Look out! Oh, forgiving good sirs. My poor old horse is blind and deaf. Thank you. Found out what you want to know. What about our ship? Hmm. After the English capture your friends, they tow her to the harbor and repair her. Perfect. We'll spend one more night on your sandpan. Then tomorrow, do me one last favor. Help us to recapture her. It will not be difficult if the price is right. Hmm. You have something else that I admire very much. Your amulet. Oh no, not the zook. We will roll for it. A pair of dice! Mm. Lady Rock has always been a friend to you. Mm. I keep the zook and you get to keep the money. Fair's fair, after all. Why did you do it, my Ling? So you noticed? I'm no stranger to loaded dice. Aren't you afraid of Yang Li? You're the one who should be careful. I don't want to see a handsome man like you fall into the hands of Lord Brooke. You feel about him the way I do. I know Sandro. But you'll he'll never leave us here to die. Maybe Sea Spider never made it to Mon Prisem. He must have made it. I never saw such a strong, fast swimmer. Sandokan might not even be back from India yet. Stop that. You sound as if you're dead already. Where's the spirit of the tiger? When Lord Brook found out our shores are rich in pearls, he dispossessed the entire population of six villages. I wish I could never again have to hear his name. <laughs> Don't worry. You've found friends now. Any enemy of James Brooks is a friend of mine. Please take me away from here, Yanitz. Please. Tonight. So, everyone know his job? Kamamori and I will be waiting in that alleyway. Be sure you each take a different road back to the sandpan. By the way, where's Yanitz? He was playing a card game! You make <gasps> that sound like a dirty word, Kamamori. I wonder what time it is. To judge by the moon, it's about midnight. This is Mei Ling. She's gonna help us. Huh? <gasps> she too has suffered at the hands of James Brooke. You must be Sandokan. I am so impressed with everything you've done. You're more than welcome to join our fight. I'm Marianne. Welcome. It was so what are you thinking about, Patan? What was so beautiful? The sky above Mont Persem. I have never seen such a beautiful moon. This will be easy. We'll find all the pitch we need in this shipyard. Does Marianne know that you've decided to get our ship back from the English? No, she has enough to worry about as it is. You're very beautiful, Mei Ling. Have you known Yanitz for very long? It seems incredible, but I met him yesterday for the first time. I know all about love at first sight. Love? Love such as you and Sandu can share, Marianne? I'm not that lucky. I know you'll find it, and you'll be happy too.
alone. It was too stuffy to sleep, so I came up for a breath of air. I think you were running away, <coughs> weren't you? You're hurting me. What's happening here? Speak up, Mei Ling. Let go. Why? A pass signed by Brooke, whom you claim to hate. Lock her up below decks. She's dangerous. A spy for Brooke. A beautiful face can hide an evil soul. Corporal Planner, make your report. By your leave, sir, all is in readiness as ordered, sir. Fine, let's get on with it. The hangman's ready for us. I'll set up my ambush here. Good luck, little brother. If I don't make it, I want you to promise you'll look after Marianne. You'll outlive us all. See you later. That's the hangman's escort. We've got to do something before they reach him. Let the hangman's assistant, boy. Stand back, you filthy louts! How dare you assault Her Majesty's forces! Sorry, chum, we had no idea. We have to get there first. That pass signed by Lord Brooke himself. The Hangman's house is at the end of this street to the right. Sergeant Rhodes, the escort is ready. Well, Sir Mal, there's four for you today. What's the matter, old boy? Cat got your tongue or something? Forgive the laymaster. Noose is now all ready. <laughs> Let's get on with it, then. to be killed and I could have had Sandokan in my hands. Into the back on my signal. Save my friends and the man I love. So touching, true love. Oh my god, please, no. Can you tell me where the bread shop is? Second please? ride, you can't miss it. Thank you, sir. Not at all, miss. If we don't leave soon, Yarrett, we will have very serious problem. Hurry! <laughs> Just in time. We have to <sighs> rendezvous with Sandokan offshore. Oh, have the prisoners come by here? No movement around here at all, sir. Just the junks and sandpans out fishing. Junks and sandpans? Prepare to pursue those craft, Captain. All hands on deck. Hoist the sails. Cast off! Fire! Reload! 
reload. They'll be within range of the next rotile. Looking for me by any chance, Brock? Huh? We meet again! You blackguard, I'll make you wish you'd never been born. Sweep him away! <laughs> Away from here immediately! Sandokan's joke worked like a charm, huh, Paco? Long live Sandokan!